This funny headband that I've got on right now is actually a portable EEG device that sits on my head and reads my brain waves to help me improve my sleep and meditation. Let's talk about it for a second. So it actually connects to your phone really easily. Uh, it makes sure that all the sensors are sitting in the right place, uh, just as you see on your screen here. And you essentially turn it on with this little button, open up your Muse app, and you're able to select between different meditations and soundscapes and biofeedback activities. And the goal with this thing is really to improve, one, your meditation skills, and two, improve your sleep. And we're gonna talk about how. So I started using the Muse 2 about two weeks ago, and I've been using it consistently for a variety of things. I'm gonna tell you all about my personal experience, and we're gonna dive into the science to see if this is something that works, is worth the investment, and is right for you. Before we dive in, I'm Dr. Jay Feldman. I'm an osteopathic physician, retired, just wearing this for fun as we review some medical devices. I run several companies, and my passion right now is optimizing my own personal productivity through meditation, through sleep, and the goal is to have as much energy as possible, be as happy as possible, and be able to work long, superhuman hours. So any device that helps me do that deserves a review. Now before we fully dive in, I wanted to share a quick story. So I've been meditating consistently for a little over a year now, and a lot of my friends just are so hesitant to start doing it, despite all the amazing benefits. One of them in particular is Scott, and the reason that he states that he won't start meditating consistently is that he doesn't think he's very good at it. And I've noticed through talking to a lot of people about their meditation practices, no one thinks they're doing it right. They won't meditate because they think it's not working. I will say that there is no device on the market that I've come across yet that will tell you whether or not you're having success and doing meditation correctly. This is the first thing. It has helped Scott start meditating. It's helped me meditate better. And it might be a good option for you to either start your meditation practice or dive a little bit deeper. All right, let's dive in. One, what does the Muse do? Two, my personal experience using Muse. And three, the pros and cons. So one of the coolest things of, that I've found about this device is what they call a digital sleeping pill. So as you know, this sits around your head and detects your brainwave through the EEG, so it knows exactly what brain state that you're in. So as far as sleep tracking goes, there is nothing better on the market. What's really cool is the digital sleeping pill. So as you're going to sleep, listening to your guided meditation, listening to your soundscape, you fall asleep, it'll actually adjust the volume down so that you can have a restful sleep and it doesn't distract you and wake you up. However, if you start to come out of your sleep for any reason, it will also detect that and it'll increase the volume so that you can then listen to your soundscape, listening to your meditation again and go back to sleep. So not only does this help you fall asleep faster, but it helps you stay asleep longer. This is also the only thing on the market that I've seen that does that. But in addition, the most accurate sleep tracking because it's literally hooked up to your brain, detecting your brain waves. So my personal favorite part of this device and the reason that I use it every single day is the guided meditations. So I haven't seen any platform, not Calm, not Headspace, that has a more in-depth, comprehensive, and high quality of meditations, soundscapes, and op sleep stories even to choose from that you can cycle through and meditate to the best of your ability. But the cool part here, and this is what separates this device from everything else, is it actually tells you how you're doing in real time. So biofeedback, it's detecting my brain waves as I'm going through a guided meditation. When I'm done with that meditation or even in the middle of it and I wanna see what state my mind was in through that meditation, I can get that data immediately right on my phone through the Muse app, it looks like this. Nothing else has been able to tell me whether I've been able to achieve a meditative state until the Muse. And I think that's really powerful for people to see visually. A lot of people will meditate and think that they're doing a good job, but they're actually not. Uh, and sometimes they actually are and just need the reassurance by looking at their phone and saying, wow, I, I was doing a good job. It said the data says it right there. So as far as meditation goes, the Muse is kind of like your coach if you're an athlete. And if you're doing something wrong as a basketball player, the only reason for, way for you to really know is if your coach tells you, hey, you're, you're dribbling wrong, you should do it like this. Or, hey, you're doing a great job, keep it up. It's hard to get into somebody's brain and coach them. So the only way to do that is through an EEG. So to have a meditation coach helps you get better at it, refine your practice, and start doing it correctly if you're not. 
So for those of you who aren't already meditating, I won't spend a long time going over the benefits. I will say there is nothing better aside from physical exercise for your personal health. Meditation has been proven to reduce anxiety, improve cognitive function, and be preventative against a lot of long-term illnesses. So if you're not already meditating, start your practice. And if this is a way to help you start, get one. So as a huge med tech nerd, as you know, I have tens of thousands of dollars worth of medical devices in my room. I use several of them daily. I was very excited to receive this and do a formal review, but let's go over some of the pros and cons of this device. Uh, let's start with the cons. And I don't think this is a real con, but I don't personally wear this for sleep every night. Having this on my head throughout the night uh, can be a little bit distracting. I think it's overkill. And I use an aura ring to track my sleep and I use uh, another device for auditory to get to sleep to meditate. So I don't use it for sleep. However, it is, it does work very well. The digital sleeping pill is a really cool tool. The tracking is awesome, it's on point. So if you not, don't already have tools to track your sleep and to get to sleep, this will definitely be a good fit for you. Other con is it's a little bit pricey. Um, if you're somebody who can't afford to spend 400 bucks on a headband to help you sleep better, it might not be a great fit for you. But if you're like me and you're a high performer, you're an entrepreneur, and you want to invest heavily into your meditation practice and your sleep, I don't think the price is by any means prohibitory. I think it's very fair for what it does. This is a portable EEG machine. It goes on my head and detects my brain waves for 400 bucks. It's pretty incredible. And obviously the pros for the Muse are everything that I listed earlier. It does help you improve your sleep. If you don't already have a sleep tool, get one. Uh, and it helps you with your meditation practice. There is nothing that I've come across so far that's gonna help you meditate better, faster, and improve your meditation like a coach. This is the only thing on the market that I know of. I'm not saying it's the only thing, it's the only thing that I've tried and that I'm aware of. So if you're somebody who's really into meditation and want to refine your practice, the Muse device is gonna be perfect for you. And if you're watching this video and you're like, oh man, I need a Muse device right now. I want to get into meditation. I want to refine it. It looks like a really cool tool for sleep. Get one. Uh, there's going to be a link in the description here uh, where you can click and get a save an additional 10% on your Muse purchase. And I will say this is a sponsored video, I, but I begged them. I begged Muse to sponsor me. Let me review their product. I really wanted to try it. I'm a huge nerd and I was very happy uh, with what I found in testing this product and using it every day. So if you're interested, uh, click on the link in the description, grab one of your own, and let me know your thoughts. And if you have any questions prior to purchasing, or maybe you already have one and want to know how I use it, drop a note in the comments. I will promise to respond personally. And if you're not already subscribed and like this type of content, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. All right, gang, thank you so much. I'll see you in the next one.